Biden administration makes 4 million more workers eligible for overtime pay and bans non-compete clauses for workers. Let's talk about how this is kind of a big deal. Non-competes. These are pesky clauses that employers often force their workers to sign, which effectively bar them from starting their own business or finding a new job in the same field within a certain area or time frame after leaving their current job. An estimated 30 million workers are currently affected by non-compete clauses. That's roughly 18% of the U.S. workforce. These clauses have been shown to lower workers' pay and restrict their opportunity and mobility. The FTC estimates that this rule will boost workers' wages by $488 billion over the next decade, with earnings for the average American worker increasing by an additional $524 per year under the new rule. It's also expected to help drive American innovation and lower spending on physician costs. Biden admin will also expand overtime pay for around 4 million lower paid salaried employees nationwide. In other words, salaried employees who work more than 40 hours per week and make under a certain amount will be required to receive overtime pay from their employers. The new rule does not change standards for hourly employees who are already protected by overtime regulations. What do you think about these? Read more of what I was starting line. Thanks for watching.